It is probably the central question of our time. Are we alone in the universe? Given the overwhelming abundance of celestial bodies we find in the cosmos, is it even possible that our Earth is the only planet that harbors life? From the official side, the facts are clear. Although experts have succeeded in tracking down more than 5,100 exoplanets, there is no proof for the existence of extraterrestrial life. In somewhat less official circles, however, it has long been rumored that our extraterrestrial neighbors actually exist, and that governments are doing everything they can to hide this knowledge from us. But what's the background of these foolhardy claims? Do these crude conspiracy theories even have a kernel of truth at the end? Let's take a deeper dive into this controversial field today. Would you like to learn more about the greatest mysteries of the universe on a regular basis? Then click on the subscribe button, activate the bell, and become part of our community. Show us with a thumbs up that you like our joint excursions to the greatest mysteries of the universe. of theories and reality. The battle between myths and facts still has no winner. Although the existence of extraterrestrial life forms is still not scientifically confirmed, some people are firmly convinced that the existence of our mysterious neighbors can no longer be denied. Surely, you have heard of the mysterious eyewitness reports of those people who claim to have seen ominous objects in the sky, things that simply cannot be assigned to any known context. But that's not all. Some people, such as the couple Betty and Barney Hill, even state that they have been abducted by aliens. Anyone who dedicates themselves to the research of this confused field will find out fast that there is a large repository of alleged proof for alien theories. Thus, the internet bristles with books, videos, and reports trying to confirm the existence of extraterrestrial life forms and the secret machinations of the governments and space agencies. Above all, NASA is accused of behaving suspiciously. For example, the cameras of the ISS livestream would always be switched over or off as soon as something comes into view that the interested world public is not supposed to see. If a mysterious something does get lost in the recording, it would then be secretly deleted from the archives. The case is said to have been similar when the ISS captured something that would have shaken us to our foundations an extraterrestrial spaceship with a diameter of almost 3,000 miles. The ISS Beyond these theories, there is no question that the International Space Station is one of the greatest success stories in modern space exploration. As the largest and longest-lived space station of our time, the 330-foot-wide and 440-ton construct regularly becomes the scene of exciting research series that could not be carried out in this form on Earth. Since construction work on the ISS began in 1998, it has been operated and continuously developed by 16 nations and five space agencies. But why did those responsible actually decide to realize the ISS, which had been planned for a long time? What advantages do space experiments have over terrestrial research facilities? The answer to this question is as simple as it is obvious. Equipment for meteorological and astronomical observations can easily be attached outside the space station. The samples to be examined are exposed to the conditions of space. For a longer period of time, those experiments that are completed inside the station, in turn, do so against a background of steady microgravity, or in other words, the state of near weightlessness. Moreover, the participating astronauts are by no means merely silent observers. In fact, the space travelers themselves repeatedly take on the role of test subjects, especially when it comes to the question of the physical and psychological consequences of longer stays in space. The other research series, of which there have been around 3,000 so far, deal with the fields of astronomy, biotechnology, physics, and materials research, as well as Earth observation. In detail, the ISS, which has so far cost over $100 billion, orbits our blue home planet at a distance of about 250 miles. The hovering space station takes just 93 minutes to completely orbit the Earth. Enigmatic Images It is a well-known fact 
that only very few of us will be able to leave our earthly home and set off into the gigantic expanses of space. But fortunately, this does not mean that we will never be able to experience the overwhelming view of the ISS astronauts. On the contrary, thanks to the 24-hour ISS live stream, we have the opportunity to slip into the skin of a space traveler from the comfort of our living room couch. For example, the space station's four cameras also captured the launch of SpaceX Starlink satellites. Brent Jett's journey to the ISS was also to be broadcast live to terrestrial receivers in 2006. While the majority of viewers enjoy the overwhelming insights of the live streams, it is suspected in other circles of people that some recordings provided us with proof of the existence of extraterrestrial life. As already briefly mentioned, however, the revelation of this knowledge is by no means approved by NASA, which is why the stream is always interrupted as soon as a UFO or another strange entity comes into the sights of the ISSI. But should we really make it so easy for ourselves and dismiss the corresponding theories simply as conspiracy narratives? Are these phenomenon and truth not due to aliens, but to conventional space junk? Let's take a look at a clip that made the controversial headline some time ago. In the corresponding shot, starting at 4 minutes and 20 seconds, we see a strangely shaped, elongated structure composed of several points of light. The rumors that followed about an extraterrestrial spaceship were immediately denied by NASA and dismissed as nonsense. But sometimes, the renowned space agency seems to shy away from unambiguous statements and instead shrouds itself in a cagey silence. In 2013, for example, some ISS images were published that are still making waves today. The images reveal a gigantic structure that appears to be in Earth orbit. The diameter of this bizarre structure was quickly put at a staggering 2,000 982 miles. Interestingly, however, the images were not to become the focus of controversial theories after their immediate publication. In fact, conjecture in this regard did not spill out on the World Wide Web until 2020. Extraterrestrial Danger? Malicious tongues would claim that the belated emergence of UFO theories is due to a combination of boredom in the corona foreclosure and a flourishing imagination. But be that as it may, the fact that the users gave free rein to their thoughts becomes clear to us when we consider the speculations that say that such a gigantic spaceship would never have set off alone for the realms of our blue home planet. The assumption that it is the mother ship of a gigantic fleet would be more likely. Other users saw in the unknown something, a kind of extraterrestrial vanguard, meant to spy out our Earth and prepare a large-scale invasion war. NASA itself, however, has in no way confirmed or acknowledged the resurfaced footage and the mind games that go along with it. But fortunately, we don't need proven experts to get to the bottom of this cosmic mystery. Some users want to know what the true background of this flying mystery is all about and that its existence has been known to us since 2017. Oumuamua. The structure captured by the ISS is claimed to be directly related to Oumuamua. This is no less than the first object observed within the solar system to be classified as interstellar. Identified on October 19, 2017 by the Pan-STARRS telescope in Hawaii, Oumuamua was initially to be categorized as a comet. However, several inconsistencies, such as the lack of a typical comet tail, quickly cast doubt on this classification. The flight behavior of our interstellar visitors visitor was also a great mystery. The body slowed down a bit less during its distance from the sun than the pure influence of gravity would have allowed. There are different assumptions about what this mysterious speed boost was all about. One explanation is based on the outgassing of volatile constituents as a result of the proximity to the sun. However, this would have led very probably also to an extreme change of the rotation behavior, a circumstance which could not be determined by the experts, however. In fact, no dust particles could be found in the immediate vicinity of the object, leading to the conclusion that Oumuamua could be made entirely of metal. Also, the unusual form, which apparently is reminiscent of a cigar, nourished the theories that this was no conventional astronomical body. While conservative explanatory theories dealt with the nitrogen ice fragment of an exoplanet, the Israeli physicist Avi Loeb put forward a much more spectacular approach. Given the conspicuous orbital deviation and the absence of dust, it's conceivable that Oumuamua has an artificial background. More precisely, the detected characteristics could well be explained 
by the properties of an extremely thin and at the same time very large solar sail. Although the investigation with the radio telescope at the Green Bank Observatory did not reveal any signals of artificial origin, quite a few people believe that there could be something to Loeb's remarks. However, the further decoding of this cosmic mystery turns out to be an extremely demanding task. After all, Oumuamua has long since turned its back on the solar system. But how do you intercept an object that races away from us at a hyperbolic speed of 16 miles per second? To put this into perspective, Voyager 1, currently mankind's fastest spacecraft, has a speed of only 10.3 miles per second. It's possible an explosive maneuver could one day help us reach our interstellar visitor after all. Namely, the ignition of a solid fuel engine could ensure that the corresponding space probe is literally catapulted out of our home system. We'll need patience for this, though. At present, this theoretical thought experiment is still far from being realized. And now we want your opinion. What do you think about the mysterious formations that sneak into the ISS images from time to time? And do you think that Oumuamua really has an artificial background? We're already looking forward to your comments. Thanks for watching, take care, and we'll see you next time.